Hello, Professor Bright here. Welcome back to the Darkest Dungeon, where we have made a decision. A possibly very poor decision. We've assembled a team and we're going after the Siren, because again, new boss. I've never experienced this one, so why not? Let's give it a shot. See how they survive. Calling themselves the Godless, so... Is that because they have great synergy? I hope so, because... Well... If they don't, they're all gonna die. Fortunately, Cruel here, Plague Doctor, Blight is effective on the Eldritch creatures that are found in the cove, and I'm hoping the Siren's Eldritch. Hopefully. Probably. And then of course we have Morphew, who's, again, bonus damage to the Eldritch enemies. Vivers, I mean, I just need to get her out there. You know, I need to get more training for my uh, Hellions, and if I do lose her, well, I mean, it's only rank 1 Hellion. And Fitton here, he's just here to become a rank 3 character so I can send him out. Ideally on some of these medium missions, which, I mean, we just need more people for those. That's the be-all and end-all of that. And as for what we're going to provision them with, uh, not all that much, actually. Because, again, our... Well, I mean, our money situation is never very good, let's be honest. Partially my own fault. In fact, some might say entirely my own fault. They would be correct, those who say such things, but... My lofty position wasn't always accompanied by the fear of office. And there was a time when I could walk the streets or raise a glass in the tavern without concern for molestation. Faithful as the tide, one precocious village waif made it her hobby to shadow my every errand. It was charming then. Troublesome later. Now, does this imply that he turned a child into the siren? I always wondered what became of the unfortunate little whiff. Oh, oh, well, that is very much implying that. Also traps there. Unfortunate, but also, oh, joy. Great. There's a map inside there and there's nothing in the map. Great, thanks. Good job, Fitton. You're doing great work. It's okay, the ancestor basically turned a child into some horrible abomination. Cool. Great. Flight these suckers. I'll do some damage, yes. Ooh, that does a lot of damage to him. Five damage per round? Oof. Cruel, you are looking more and more powerful by the day. Breakthrough or Wicked Hack. I mean, this has a chance to kill him. Didn't kill him, so that's unfortunate. Especially since we really need to kill that thing ASAP. Good job, Cruel. Staying alive, staying alive. I like it, I like it. I like what you are doing and how you are doing it. Uh, mm, no, not quite good enough. Uh, that is kind of unfortunate. Um, I mean, Intimidate has a chance to kill this one outright, and it debuffs this one. So, I would say it's worth it. Yes, yes, destroy everybody. Unfortunately, that does mean we won't kill this guy this round. Ah. That's quite unfortunate. Too bad. That one's still dead, which means one less thing for me to deal with. And I only have to deal three damage to the... Oh, to the grouper. Well. Unfortunate. That does mean he is a little bit stronger than he was before, which is... Quite unpleasant for me. Um. Hmm. Ah, you could use with extra strength. Yeah, yeah. Use that extra strength from the emboldening vapors. Kill that one. Kill them both. Please, please stop taking hits. That, that would be lovely if you did. Weaken him. As best we can. Get to chopping. This one's dead no matter what, so... Uh, if it bleeds... No, that decreases damage and... Bleeding isn't really a thing that these guys do. So, a little bit of damage, not much, but hey, it improves things. Okay, good, dodge, great. Lovely. Guys are doing great work, great work indeed. Eh, might as well heal her a bit. Just a wee bit. Slowly. Gently. Gently. This is how a life is taken. Yes, yes, I'm aware of that, thank you. He only has two, oh. Oh, that, that's heartbreaking. 
he could be so much deader than he is now. He's also doing practically no damage, so just, yeah. Put him out of his misery. There we are. Oh, and the treasure... Oh. The map actually did, you know, map out. Just not immediately. Okay, a little bit weird. Anyway, treasure's that way, but there's stuff this way. Stuff which might have value. And by value, I mean just terrible, terrible, oh, terrible consequences. Yep, that's unpleasant. Always with the wanting food. God, you people are just disappointing. So disappointing. Okay, aim for the back. Hmm, extra damage. Not a fan of that. Not a fan at all, I've got to say. Alright, five damage done to him. Five damage done to him, okay. Alright, progress. Breakthrough might be worth doing. Although it does move her forward. Hmm. No, we'll just attempt to kill this one? Yes. Ah, oh, Vivers. You're hurting me. Hurting me deep inside. Fitting, not doing much better. But, yeah! Ooh, 32 damage. Ooh, that's a thing of beauty. Unfortunately, again, that does mean I don't get to kill them both, but I get to kill this one. No, come on. Come on, Morphew. You could do better than that. That was a stupid move on your part, but okay. So he has to do one move and then dies next round. Great. That's less good, but, uh, well, we'll deal with that. Great, you critted him for two damage. Fair enough. Uh, are you... You're not as resistant to bleed as these ones are, so... Oh, you're dead no matter what, so it doesn't even matter. Cool. You start getting damaged. Hmm. No, I'm not gonna bother with the Intimidate. Oh, fighting, you're just... Doing beautiful work. Beautiful, beautiful work. Bleed resistance is great. That one's dead. And that one as well. Do I get a chance to heal? That would be lovely. Ah, uh, yeah, good job. I even managed to not bleed her to death. Great, good job. This might just undo your hard work. Nope, didn't. Good, progress, kill it. Their formation is broken. Technically should have gone for Solemnity there, but you know what, I didn't. Because the thing needed to die. And you... I didn't pack any holy water. Um, what if I burn it? No. Which makes sense because it's, you know, made of rock. Also, it's clearly Cthulhu, but you know, that's neither here nor there. It's an off-brand Cthulhu. And loot of some value? Yes. Not much, mind you, just a few bandages. But I can find use for that. Okay. And? Nothing. Alright, I'm gonna gamble and say that the... Mm, unpleasant. Say that the boss is not in this middle room here. But it's in fact in this room on the upper area. I know, very specific. But yeah. And then I'm wondering how she works. We're gonna camp for a bit. Gather Just a regular little full one. An uneasy companionship. Hmm. Let the mask down, no. Bloody shroud. You know what? That might be very useful. You can sharpen spear, which does increase crit chance, which is really nice. Uh da da da. Minus thirty stress. Sharpen Spear seems like the best choice so far. Hmm. Extra healing and healing received. Ooh. Could be useful. Could find a place for that. Prevents nighttime ambush. Done. And let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Sharpen Spear, I think, is the best option for you. And for you, uh, just, you know what? De-stress this guy. Then the unguents, that's nice. 
And guess what? You're disease resistance. Hmm. Injection shall fortify against any internal assault on my flesh. Great! According to plan. <laughs> well, so far. Good health. We're straight packed as a royal guard. Good! Okay. How are you going to forge timber in this place? Please, do tell me. And you in stop your belly aching. We find victory. Oh no, my stomach aches. We won't survive. Ugh. A handsome reward. <laughs> for a task well performed. If by handsome you mean barely sufficient. Sure. Uh? Do I find out where the boss is? I do. Perfect. And I have no obstacles between me and the boss. Great. At least if this is the boss. Pretty sure it is. We'll find out in a moment. Oh, hello. Medicinal herbs. I mean... No. Because we don't have any need to use the food in order to heal. Because we can't do that during combat, so... Yeah, this should be fine. And there she is. Devils have remade the poor girl in their image. She is their queen. And their slave. Okay, problem. She's not big enough that Cruel can blight her. Other problem. They turned a small girl into some sort of queen slash slave slash whatever she... Oh, hey, lady. Oh, gross. Shop. Do some damage. Oh, this doesn't even look like it's going to be that bad. Unless it is that bad. Mmm, it's going to be bad. Good news, though. Now she's further back. Which, in theory, would mean I could damage her, but apparently she just dodges, so it's fine. Um, hmm, do I deal with the ads or do I deal with her? Weaken the ad for me. Song of Desire. Let's see if this hits. No debuff so far. Good, good, good. Blight, though, it's not quite effective enough, I don't think. Uh, yeah, good chances, but still taking a chance. Devour. Um, oh. Well, isn't that lovely? Do some damage, please. Thank you. Fit in here, just doing beautiful work. Beautiful, beautiful work. Yes, yes, if it bleeds, we can kill it. Uh, does it bleed, though? Not really likely. So maybe we just do more damage to him or to her. I don't know. This one. Okay, that works. I will feast on your heart. God damn, Vivers is a hell of a woman. Possibly the best person. Best person on the team, period. Yeah, does some damage to him. Play grenade won't actually hit. Uh, hmm. Emboldening Vapors on this one. Extra damage for him or extra damage for her. Extra damage for her. We need more. More hitting. More killing of these things. Intimidate. Now, will this actually damage them both? It does. Good. So, good to know. AoE basically counters any type of tanking move. Oh, shit. He can... She can do what Sirens can do. Shit. Uh, for how long? How long does this last? Is it permanent? God, I hope it isn't permanent. Good thing is, she's not doing too much damage. And we should be able to kill her before he's getting a chance to do too much. I hope. We'll find out. Uh, I mean, well, we can curse help or hinder him? I don't know. Um, uh, shoot. Well, we'll weaken this one. I know that helps me. Do not threaten my queen. Fear, battlefield medicine, not good. But he's healing himself, so that's good. It's progress. Uh, damage her while we can. We almost have her dead. And now he's back here. Oh, okay, cool. So that's just like a one-round debuff. Nothing I actually need to worry about. We almost have her killed. Lovely. In fact, this might do it. And if it blights her? Nope, not quite. Pity that. 
No. No, no, no. No, no, no. That's not what you're supposed to do at all. Oh, why are you dodging, lady? Um, hmm. Not much in the way of choices, so... Well, no. I can protect him. Which would be nice if that also marked him, but you know what? That's okay. Should have damaged him in hindsight, but, you know. Options, options, options. Oh. How much bleed does that do? Not that much. Good. Okay. I can make something out of this. Yeah, killing blow of one damage. Oh no. Yes, yes, I know. You need a band-aid. Uh, you know what? Actually, you're gonna get a band-aid. So that is a little bit much in the way of, uh... Yeah. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. Hmm, no, not what I wanted. But yes, bandages because, uh, well, we're in a little bit of a spot. Have a few problems, and you're going to make a move. Yep, devouring, great, good. Good choice. I'd love to know how all those tentacles fit inside that thing, but you know what? Not going to worry about that. Going to worry primarily about killing this guy, because we got to kill him to get to you. These waters are my home now. Uh, no, not so much. A barbaric yawp? I don't think I gave you the ability to yawp. In fact, I'm almost positive I didn't give you the ability to yawp. Hmm. Suspicious. The tides took you. Uh-huh. So we noticed. No. Okay, good. He resisted it. Great. Progress. Unfortunately, she's in the back now, which is going to cause me all sorts of problems. Why are you getting multiple moves? Could, could someone explain that to me? I'm quite displeased by it. Um, hmm. Yeah. Because if it double blights him, he's dead. Great. Uh, solemnity or shopping? Um, I mean, killing him isn't really worth anything because he's going to die next round no matter what. Although possibly it could have been worth something. And that AoE damage is lovely. I just need to make one more move and she's dead. All I need is one turn. One turn where I can actually do something. Would have been, you know, nice. Anyway. Come on. This is actually a ridiculously easy boss. I mean, overall. Sure, she can turn people to her side, but I mean... Besides that, she can't really do all that much. High Tide, which means she's going to summon something. But I don't really care about this little deep stinger thing, because I'm just going to finish her off. Like, actually, yeah, like so. And that is that. I'm not sure the roots are safe, actually, because, uh, well, yeah all of this happening plus the fact that there are at least five five more bosses i was going to say three more bosses not true five i believe haha indeed and we got jester dies nightmarish creatures can be spelled they can be beaten they can be and we're done killed ourselves a siren who used to be a little girl great so wonderful Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Murdered what used to be a kid. I'm sad now. Oh dear, stress faster. Minus 100% food consumed if stress above 50. Interesting, kind of useful, I guess. Sort of. Eagle Eye, very useful. And yeah, we now have three more guys on rank 3. Excellent. One of them's even a healer, so we can take on those medium difficulty... The greatest oh. of all. By hateful curse or malign... <laughs> Sorry. By hateful curse or malign miracle, it seems even death may be defied in this damnable place. Only one of these soldiers can be returned to the living. I mean... Who is he? Tustein? Lucellis? Or Bondeville? Bondeville? Bondeville. To those with a keen eye... 
gold gleams like a dagger's point. So you say. Anyhow. So yeah, we have made progress. We have killed our first enemy in the cove. Our first boss in the cove, rather. And yeah, that's actually a pretty effect. I like that. And we have Bonneville back all of a sudden. So how you doing since you died? An early riser. Oh, yeah, something like that. I'm gonna throw you into the abbey, though, because, uh, one, you came back from the dead. That's kind of unusual. Suspicious, one might say. Yes, yes, shush. Okay, next episode, we have business to attend to. Uh, who else wants to join us? Oh, lovely Moorhound Masters. Sort by stress, please, because I kind of want to know. Yeah, no class, thank you. Do I still have a second Houndmaster? I do. I already have an extra one. I suppose we could bring in another Abomination, but I mean... Do I really want a second one? Not really. And none of you have any talent, any skill, or capability. You disappoint me. Still, next episode we shall continue to get more bosses unlocked and make progress towards finding our way back to this 8-pounder and just destroying it. But for now, thank you for your time. Note the like, comment, and subscribe buttons below. Use them responsibly. And I shall see you all soon.